it's Lainey, your independent Sensi consultant. Welcome back to my channel, to the Sensi version of my channel. And today I am sharing the bakery scents of the 2019 fall winter catalog. So the bakery is an ode to edible, delectable sweet goodies. It includes notes like vanilla, caramel, cocoa, and pie crust. So the first scent that we have today is apple butter frosting. Sensi says it's a heartwarming medley of cinnamon spiced apple and decadent vanilla buttercream. So, apple butter frosting. Ooh. That smells really nice. I don't know about you, but I love the bakery scent. Especially, it's it's great like in the kitchen. I definitely can tell, I can smell the cinnamon and the buttercream. Mmm, this one's a really good one. Yep. Yeah, in the kitchen, it's really nice. It's very warming, and you're going to have people running into your kitchen thinking you're baking because these all smell like baked goods. So this is apple butter frosting. The second one is apple cherry strudel. Granny Smith cherry and vanilla drizzle. In insist on dessert first, it says. Apple strudel, apple cherry strudel. Ooh. Hmm. This smells like I just mashed up some cherries. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. If you mash up, if you, if you took an apple slice and a cherry and you mash it all together, you would definitely smell that. That's nice. Apple cherry strudel. The second one is everybody's favorite, baked apple pie. Flaky, flaky, excuse me, flaky crust apples and spices combined in a strong scent. Baked apple pie. Oh yeah, definitely baked apple pie. I just um, I just ordered uh, a few of these for. I think I might have mentioned before uh, a real little friend of mine. She gets these and she hangs them up around. She so she has um, she got some car bars, and she's sticking them on the vents in the in the um, you know how sometimes I think. Mine's like that. You have uh, the vents where the air conditioning comes out. Well, she's clicking a car bar on the on the air vent so that when the AC is running, it's it's um, throwing off the scent. So that's what she's got uh, baked apple pie. So it's a great idea, right? I use the car bars for um, the cat box. That works really well too. Not not in the bakery scent, but in the um, like the fresh scent, like clothesline or something like that. Clean breeze. Anyways, back to the bakery. Uh, the next one is blueberry cheesecake. Thick, rich New York cheesecake with a light graham cracker crust and delicious blueberries. This is a bestseller, by the way, you guys. So this is, oh yeah, this smells just like it. Yep. It, it, it tastes, it smells just like blueberry cheesecake. Absolutely. All you cheesecake lovers out there, you definitely want to try the blueberry cheesecake. And it has no calories. That's even better. Uh, the next one is blueberry pancakes. It's blueberry and butter accord over light maple. Make the mood. Blueberry pancakes. Whew. 
Oh, that smells like... Hmm, what does that smell like? I smell the blueberries and I smell the, the maple, yep. I don't smell butter, but smell blueberry and maple. It's a pretty purpley color too. And you know when you melt these, if you have like, a, I don't have one here to show you, but if you melt these in a, like a clear uh, warmer, the color purple is gonna like fill up your room and, and the color that it's in. I know in my bathroom I have red and um, right now I have red and it like it gives off a red light when it's on, so it's very nice. So yeah, this is purple, by the way. So blueberry pancakes. The next one is breakfast blend. Get buzzed on the pure scent of rich, just brewed coffee. This is one of my favorites. Breakfast blend. I even drink breakfast blend. Oh yeah, coffee. Heaven. Yep. It smells like you're walking by Starbucks at the mall. That's what it smells like. <sighs> yep. One of my favorites, you guys, a breakfast blend. Okay, the next one is brownie batter. This is another favorite of my friend. <sighs> it smells like fresh baked brownies. I kid you not. Smells exactly like your bacon brownies in the oven. Ugh. It's just amazing. So once again, my friend ordered this one in car bars as well. <laughs> oh, so good. Wait a minute. Yep. And once again, zero, zero points, no calories. Brownie batter. That's brand new this year. It's really good. Next one is a butter pecan. This one reminds me when I used to be able to eat ice cream. <sighs> yep. Butter pecan ice cream is what it reminds me of. <sighs> butter pecan. If fall had a flagship fragrance, this, this blend of candied pecan and maple folded with butter would be a strong contender. Yep. To me, that's what it smells like, butter pecan ice cream. The next one is candied cranberry pecan. This is red in color. Ooh. That's nice. That's very refreshing. This is new this year. This is classic cranberries, which uh, you can smell the cranberries. Pecans are sweetened with sugar cane and a ribbon of brandied plum. And you know, you can smell, you can smell all of these in that particular order, <laughs> really. It depends on which angle you smell it at, you know what I mean? You can smell the cranberries and then the pecans. Yeah, sugar cane and the, the plum. Very nice, this is very nice. Cranberry, candied cranberry pecan. And that's a new one, I think I said that, that's a new one. Um, the next one is caramel vanilla delight. Vanilla ice cream, liquid caramel, and a splash of white rum. Well, that sounds heavenly. Oh, oh, it's all my karma lovers out there. Oh my goodness. This smells like, oh God. What does that smell like? It smells like a candy I used to have as a kid. Like, but it doesn't have honey in it. I don't know what I'm smelling. To me, it smells like those, you know those little nut, I don't know, nut and honey, 
Ugh. Nut and honey bars or something. Oh, that one smells really good. I smell a nut in here for some reason. I don't know why, but there's no nut in it. It's vanilla ice cream, caramel, and white rum. Maybe it's the rum I'm smelling. Yeah, it must be the rum, but it smells nutty to me. So that is really nice. That's a nice one. So that's Caramel Vanilla Delight. The next one is Churro Churro. I smell these every time I go to Costco. They make me want, they make me drool. Baked pastry sprinkled with cinnamon sugar captures that heavenly churro charm. Yep. Did you ever have a churro at Costco? That's what it smells like. Yep, that's what it is, all right. Another zero-point food. <laughs> no calories. Okay, the next one is gingerbread donut. Heavenly golden gingerbread, spiced donut, and vanilla bean. Ooh, that's a nice combination. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. That one is, oh yeah, that's nice. You got all, once again, you get all the scents, the gingerbread, the, the spiced donut, and the vanilla bean. Wow, that vanilla bean kicks in the other two scents. It kicks up the other two scents. Hmm, golden gingerbread, spiced donut, yeah. Uh, that's nice. That's very nice. Very nice. It's like a, I don't know, like a tannish beige kind of color. Very nice. Gingerbread color, I guess. And this one, the next one is Hug in a Mug. I like the name alone. Curl up with chocolate hazelnut and cookie dough. Now, this one. I smelled this one before. This one, to me, smells like Nutella. And my daughter thinks it smells just like hot chocolate. Yeah, it's very good. Hug in a mug, it's called. It's weird, it's, and this is, it, this is a bestseller also, so, Hug in a mug. It, it's weird that different people's noses, like I've said before, they they all you all sniff differently. You all have your different versions of what something ooh, something smells like. So, okay, the next one is mocha doodle, delicious roasted coffee beans and cocoa, balanced with sugar, caramel, and heavy cream. Okay, can you guess? Another one of my favorites. <sighs> yep, this one is just <sighs> pure heaven. <sighs> okay. I love to burn this, melt this, burn it, melt it in my kitchen. You walk in there and it's like, just like you're walking into your comfort zone, you know? And it's like, you just kind of like melt because all these, all these scents and flavors are like, oh, you remember that as a kid, that your mom was making, you know, um, cookies and, or you're brewing coffee or you're, you're making caramel coffee. Um, you're making like hot cocoa and caramel and it's just, that's what it, that's what it reminds me of is you're making a cake cup of hot chocolate. You have a little caramel sauce in there and some whipped cream. <laughs> I'm making everybody hungry for uh, iced coffee, but that's what it smells like. It smells really good. And that is a mocha doodle. Next one is pumpkin roll. This is a 
a favorite for this time of year. Oh, this one, creamy pumpkin pie, filling surrounded with yellow cake, pecans, butter, and spice. And that's what it, exactly what it smells like is a pumpkin roll. I love all the pumpkin scents in the in the fall. I even like to blend. I've even blended a couple together, like this um, pumpkin roll, and I think there's a pumpkin pie, and a harvest, harvest. No, I'll figure it out. But there's like two or three different pumpkin ones that I'll put in together. I'll put like a cube of each one. Oh, it smells amazing. So that is the pumpkin roll. The next one, I'm probably going to pronounce it wrong. It's called Stroop, well, Stroop Waffle Delight. This is a new one. Uh, a cozy twist on a traditional Dutch treat made with creamy vanilla, rich melted butter, and cinnamon. I know they, like I said before, they kind of all sound like they have the same ingredients, but they, like, it depends on how it's made. Each layer is different. Ooh. Oh, I like this one. Uh-oh. This is going to have to go into one of my favorites pile. Hmm. Oh boy. Vanilla, melted butter, and cinnamon. <sighs> yep. Huh. <sighs> that one is heaven, let me tell you. Oh, that one's good. Stroop Waffle. I even like the name. Stroop Waffle. And this one here is an old time classic vanilla uh, sugar cookie. Warm, sweet blend of butter and sugar and creamy vanilla. Yep, taste, taste. I keep saying taste. It smells like, exactly like a sugar cookie. Now this, the sugar cookie, can be added to any one of these and it's going to intensify that scent. Um, I would I haven't tried it yet, but I think I'm going to try adding the sugar cookie to the brownie batter and the sugar cookie with the apple butter frosting. If it sounds great to eat, I'm pretty darn sure it's going to smell good. So that's on my plan. <laughs> the last one in the bakery sex selection of scents is vanilla bean buttercream this is a bestseller it's decadent buttercream frosting made with the freshest butter whipped with sugar cane and vanilla extract this one is super uh, vanilla bean buttercream Smells exactly like buttercream. So, if you put the sugar cookie with the vanilla buttercream frosting, butter, butter, vanilla bean buttercream, that's very hard for me to say, with the sugar cookie, that would be amazing. So, that is all I have for you right now. That is the whole fall winter 2019 collection of bakery scents and if you like what you see give me a comment down below i'd love to read all your comments suggestions check out my my website it i'll have it linked down below it's wicklesswithlaney.sensi.us and i am also um if you're interested in having a online party or a tote party. Um, yep, yeah, so that is all that I have right now. I hope you enjoyed this video and you could kindly give me a like and a thumbs up. And like I said, leave me a comment down below and stay tuned for the next video. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.